Hi, welcome, Simon here, and hope you're doing well. In this video, I'll be doing a battery replacement on an HP laptop. This is the battery replacement, and if you're not sure where to buy it, I'll link it down in the description below, where it will direct you to either Amazon or eBay, where you can find that replacement battery from the website. All right, so let's dive right into it. Identify the model here. This is HP 17-CN. 3053CL. Alright, let's talk about the problem. If you have problem with holding the charge, meaning that the computer only lasted you less than 30 minutes, or maybe that the touchpad at the bottom is not clickable, or you feel like there's a lump on the touchpad, or maybe in the back of the computer, if it doesn't sit flush, flat on the surface, it kind of like wobbles, then more likely the battery has swollen and pushes from the inside out so those are the typical signs that you want to look for and if it does apply to you then maybe you do need a battery replacement all right so here i have the metal prying tool i'm gonna go underneath that little rubber because we need to peel the thing off and expose the hidden screws underneath get a regular phillips screwdriver Once I've removed the four screws on the top, there are two screws strike in the center, in the middle section on the left and the right. And you have two more screws here at the very bottom. Once I've removed the screws, let me kind of identify if there's any hidden screw here. Oh, they do. So you definitely need to peel that rubber at the very bottom as well. There are two more hidden screws here. Okay, once you've removed all the screws, the next step is to go ahead and pry open the back cover. I'll be using a metal prying tool and this is enough to go in between that gap. Once I have a little bit of the opening, I like to use the plastic prying tool to run across the plastic because the metal prying tool might put a little scratch on the plastic. So Okay, close it down. Now we go a little bit and remove the entire back cover. Here at the very bottom, you can see that the battery is connected to the motherboard by one, two, three, four screws. So get a Phillips screwdriver, go ahead and remove the screws. Okay, once you have removed all the four screws, it should be very easy and straightforward. What you want to do is just lift up the uh, battery like such. And to install, just leave it back in. And there you have it. And make sure you have all the four screws to go back into the battery, as well as the back cover. Close it up and all the screws to go back in and you should be all set. Very straightforward easy and again uh, check the link down description below i'll link it to either amazon or ebay where you can find a replacement battery and um, if you do find this video is helpful please go ahead and smash the like button for me and if you want to show appreciation support my work on my channel uh, thanks for sharing the gratitude by clicking the youtube super thanks all right until next time bye now